Millions of Americans have wear and tear arthritis that affects the knees. For many, pain medication, braces, or rehab don't provide enough relief, so they turn to total knee replacement surgery. But now there's a new, less invasive robotic option. NJN News Health and Medical Correspondent Sarah Lee Kessler reports. When your knee looks like this, bone on bone, cartilage completely worn away, it causes excruciating pain. I couldn't walk. Every, the, getting up in the morning was like a living hell. So 50-year-old Stephen Hayek, a former fire inspector, turned to Dr. Richard Boyardo of St. Michael's Medical Center for help. He recommended partial knee replacement surgery. The reason? The kneecap compartment is intact, lateral compartment is intact, so he, he emerges as a perfect candidate for this particular unicompartmental procedure. The procedure, which is just a few years old, is known as makoplasty and is the latest in computer-guided robotic surgery. One of the big parts of this replacement that's a big positive is that no ligaments are cut. That means a shorter hospital stay and a quicker recovery than with total knee replacement surgery. I was walking the same day after the surgery, 12 hours I was up and walking, and within 24 hours I was home, home, walking full, with full weight on it. But partial knee replacement can be tricky because basically the damaged bone has to be smoothed away so you can get a precise fit, otherwise the replacement joint won't fit properly. The good news, according to Dr. Boyardo, is that the robotic arm and the 3D calculations provided here accomplish that. Knee sculpting must be done within the confines of the green zone, seen here on the computer screen. Otherwise, the robotic arm will shut off. And the computer shows the surgeon exactly where to put the replacement parts. We take that five to seven degrees margin of surgeon error out of the equation, and it's precise every time, reproducible every time. Hayek, who underwent surgery at St. Michael's six weeks ago, is grateful to Dr. Boyardo. This guy gave me my life back. He gave me my life back. I mean, Sarah Lee Kessler, NJN News, Newark.